What's going on, you guys? Welcome back to another. My name is Jeff. Reacts. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day today. Once again, it's not the best day outside, but I always say count your blessings because you never know. You know, not to be depressing on you, but you know, life is weird. Just try to stay positive no matter what's going on. I hope you guys are having a good day, and if not, I hope I can bring some sort of positive light to your day because, guys, whatever's going on for you, whatever it may be, just remember that you are not alone. You are never alone. You are a warrior. You are a soldier. Stay strong. I believe in you. And if you need it, the comments are there for you to vent, or you can DM me personally on my socials. But you do got this. You're awesome, unique in every single way, guys. I love you all. Try to stay strong. Bro fist. High five. You got this, guy. Now, I know you're all probably getting really tired of Tom McDonald at this point, but I'm trying to really go through and do most of the songs that I don't know. And I know one of you requested this song at some point, so... I'm not even going to waste too much time. I'm going to dive right in. Tom McDonald, hell of it. Dude's been killing it. Seriously, I love this guy, guys. Why do I already feel like I recognize the music video, but I don't remember much of the song? They try to tell me I should dumb it down. Say you're too conscious for the fans to feel you. Try to tell me I should calm it down. If you fight the system, they gon' try to kill you. They try to tell me that I'm too sad and it isn't healthy. F I knew that. I'm just doing me. And if you don't agree and I don't owe you, f then that is too bad. I fired shots at all the mumble rappers. And they try to say I'm not a humble rapper. So I tell them I'm not like these other rappers. And they try to say I'm just another rapper. But I guess there's no pleasing, y'all. If the record has meaning, you don't leave it on. But you stream all the songs that repeat the same f about Xanax and liquor and drugs. I could have a seizure like Wayne. I could just go OD like Peep. I could just go crazy like Yay. I could just get locked up like Meek. Repeat the same thing. Use some stupid slang. Yelling Gucci gang on every flame beat. Or I could be me. At least I can breathe. At least I can sleep. Knowing that I never sold myself for money or a dream. These rappers all coked out. They just mumble lots. They got broke mouths. They got 10 chains and got no house. They got 20 hooks and got no spouse. Smart rappers don't drink lean. That's kid. We ain't 16. If you got a problem, I welcome it. Watch it real quick. I like how this one is very toned down compared to the other ones he usually does, like the newest one, Dirty Money or Snowflakes and everything. When he's shouting, not he's rapping, but he's shouting everything that he says. He's not getting angry. This one he's just toned down, like, hey, I'm I'm just gonna talk to you guys. I'm just gonna be real with you. I don't really care what you say about me. I know I'm different than the rest of you. I know I don't follow the same narrative and push my own agenda I just do me and you can either hate me for that or love me for it I know there's a lot of you out there that hate me for it but guess what I'm doing this to be me I'm doing it for the hell of it I don't care what you say as usual well done Tom even just the most subtle mature way it's Saying I'm whack. I try to tell him that it's complicated. I could write a novel about getting faded, but the conscious fans are gonna hate it. And the wavy kids are gonna love to play it. So I write a song that's got a message in it. And the wavy kids are saying it's pathetic. But the conscious fans think it's awesome, man. They comment like, man, I really get it. So what the do y'all want? I could have a seizure like Wayne. I could just go OD like Pete. I could just go crazy like Ye. I could just get locked up like Meek. I could just go sell out like Jay. I could just stay real like Wally. I could just get money like Dre. Or I could just say. I don't really have anything to add there, just Tom being real as always. Sorry, something was kind of... I'm good. Sorry. Let's get back... Ah, freaking A. Let's get back into it. We'll finish this out. Like Drake, or I could just say that I'm done playing games and get famous and know that I always stay me. So go ahead and bump the mumble rap. Don't boycott it, just understand. If you eat at McDonald's, you're gonna get fat. If you listen to garbage, your head fills with trash. Get drunk in the club and spend all your money. Because rappers have told you what makes you somebody. They comment on this with your jelly... For the hell of it. For the hell of it. They 
set to go to hell, so I packed my and went with it. Little did they know that they put me in my element. I'm fired to the bone now, diamonds in my skeleton. I'm finally in my zone, doing me for the hell of it. For the hell of it. Yep, true story there, but story. Pretty much the same as uh, I Don't Care was about, or uh, Dear Rappers. You know, just kind of the same song, just different jabs, just a little bit more quiet, just talking about, you know, the industry shoved him out for trying to be different, and now he's successful without a label. They pushed him out, and he's still succeeded guarantee you a lot of people told him he would never make it. i know a lot of people told him he would never make it and yet look where he is this one is just quieter this one is just less shouting i mean i don't mind when he does the shouting i still think he's talented i'm just saying this is the quieter spectrum this is the quieter side but he's still making the jabs he's still saying that he made it without doing the same exact thing that they did the only reason they say you have to do this stuff they, they have all the money all the power and everything to make you famous just like that but not everybody wants to do that and they try to fill your head with doubt and negativity that you can only make it by listening to them but people not just Tom I mean yes Tom is huge right now he's an excellent um, example but not just Tom there's a lot of people out there like Tom that have made it for not listening to the industry, for not doing what the labels tell them, for not listening to following trends or following a certain narrative or whatever, for literally just doing what they want to do. There's people out there like Tom that are killing it and actually making it just by doing that. It's absolutely impossible to do that. Don't let them tell you what you can and can't do. Don't let people tell you what you can and can't do. Don't let, shall I say, the industry, whatever you're going for, don't let them tell you what you can and cannot do or can't say or whatever just do what you're gonna do be yourself and people the right people will follow I don't know how to rephrase it a hundred more times but the simple fact of the matter is this is a, a jab again at the industry because they simply told them he wouldn't make it they wanted him to follow a certain way he said no he's one of the number one he is he's the number one artist right now in the country and they won't even acknowledge it because they're not because they're woke and he's not. But guess what? He's still making the bucks. He's still getting the numbers. They hate him. They absolutely, they don't just dislike it. They're not just mad. They hate him for what he's doing. He's telling the truth. He's speaking everything for what it is. He's speaking his own truth. He's literally doing his own thing and not following the narrative. Getting just as big as them, if not bigger in the process. Oh, you bet they hate that. You'd think all this woke crap, they would see that they're losing money with this but they don't as long as there's people still out there listening and paying for this stuff they're gonna keep pushing it go woke go broke stop it anyways i'm gonna shout out from here tom you killed it as always brother much love and respect man keep it up seriously you guys in the comments let me know what you think let me know what other tom songs you want me to check out i'm loving it i hope you enjoyed today's video thank you so very much for watching please comment like and subscribe and as always remember my name is jeff Pep Junkies Unite, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Love, peace, and chicken grease. You guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic night.